Hello nieces and nephews and welcome to my channel you guys. Happy springtime. Yes, this is the first day of spring and I decided to do a little spring stockpile cleaning. And you guys, a few months ago, I transformed my whole closet into my stockpile area and I didn't have that much to show you guys or oh, I did not um, purchase a lot of stockpile items but I knew at some point I was going to need more space take a quick look at what my stockpile looked like back in August of 2018 Take a look at how my stockpile closet look now, March 2019. And voila. Yes, you guys, um, I got a little bit more products. Everything is more spaced out. And I added some shelving to this closet so I'll have more room, well, room for more. All right. As you see, I told you I was low on toothpaste, so your girl is getting stopped. And you guys, this is the time where they have awesome sales and deals. And I hope you checked out my two-part CVS couponing trip that I just posted in the wee hours of the night. All right, I'm just going to show you, just give you a rundown real quick on how I came about this. These are some extra shelving because I wanted to use the space available so you can purchase these things from Dollar General, Walmart, and you can use them. And I just um, want to use them for the little tin um, lotions. That's what I plan on using them for. And the top shelves are going to be used for the big toilet paper and paper towels. Then, of course... I still have those clear containers that I purchased from Five and Below. That's my deodorant. And you guys, there's a mix of different kinds. So I'm not separating according to color, sizes, and stuff yet. Because I'm just, my stockpile is not there yet. Okay? Then I have my lotions. Okay, and this is the toothpaste, toothbrushes. And as you see, I have plenty of room for more. You guys, the way I had it before... It looked like I had a whole lot because everything was crammed into these, just these shelves. And I used this area over here as a regular storage area with my carpet cleaner, vacuum cleaner, things like that. So I have that removed at this shelf. And I inserted um, this shelf and I picked the shelf from Walmart. You guys, it costs... Um, and my store costs about $30. I'm going to enter the um, web page right here. So it was, I mean, it fit perfect, you guys. You can't get any perfect than this all right and right here you guys i had a chef evidently my mouthwashes and my cosmetics basket was getting too heavy and it buckled so i just removed that ledge and i put in my three drawer um sterilite container there and i put my feminine products then i got a basket of my boxes of feminine wipes then I got two huge bags on the bottom where you have the candy and um, cake mix um, clearance little kids that's a kid bag where if I'm making a basket for a kid I can look in there to pick up some items to um, put that basket together and I also use shoe boxes you can get these from Dollar Tree you guys and I got um, toothbrushes in here and it's more room I can stop I can um, stack another shoe box on top of there and I got my floss and picks in this one here and up here I have the small packages of toilet paper 
I have my air fresheners here, which I probably end up putting them in another area um, because I think these top shelves are just going to be um, paper products when as I um, as my stockpile grow. My wipes, my small uh, facial tissues. I rarely buy bar soap, but if I do, it used to be Iris Spring, you guys. Iris Spring or Dove. And those soaps right there I kind of picked up from Dollar Tree. And I have all those hand soaps over there. And body wash. And you know, that's definitely going to grow. Because we use our items. I only buy items that me and my family love and use. Okay. And then I put two baskets at the bottom. And you guys, maybe like three years ago, I got those big baskets down there. They're fairly big. Um, let me give you an idea of how big um, they are. I guess if I get a bar of Dove soap, you'll kind of know how big the basket. They're kind of big. And you guys, I got them on clearance at Staples about three years ago for about a dollar. So I got a few of those. And I end up... Um, putting together stockpile baskets for my daughters, my um, my ex-husband's family to give away for Christmas one year. And I had two, th two of them left. So I just simply put shampoo and conditioners in there. Shampoo, conditioner there. And then like hair styling products in there. And you guys, for real, I don't really like shopping for shampoo and conditioner because I cannot use, use it fast enough. Then I use a command hook with... Um, this bag, my grandmother made these bags when she, were, when she was working. She used to make patio furniture. She's an awesome seamstress. So I, I kept those bags and I put a command hook and that's where I keep uh, first aid items. You see my back, my back um, patches right there. Then I have like medicines and things like that I get on, um, on sale or for couponing. But yeah, you guys. This is my <laughs> revamped stockpile closet. I just wanted to revamp, revamp it so I can add more as these deals are um, coming. Because you guys, ready or night, they going to come. And I'm thinking by the end of summer, as the season change again, I probably will give you another stockpile, stockpile view to show you how in little time your stockpile can grow. Now, keep in mind, we use this all the time. We use this, uh, these items all the time. So, yeah. <laughs> so, you'll be surprised how little bit of time that these stockpile can grow so yeah that's it you guys um check out the link that i'm putting in the description box for this shelving unit and um my laundry detergent i keep in my um, laundry room because there's a lot down there too so i got different areas for different things then in my um closet um in my youtube room i keep all my items like my gift sets um, items I make baskets with and things like that because I prepare gift baskets in my YouTube room now. So this is Strictly Stockpile. So y'all like this video, subscribe, like, comment down the middle, and I will see you guys soon. Smooches! Happy spring stockpile cleaning!